Classic Rock 94.9 and 104.5. It is Shaggy. And live on the phone with me, you might know him from the hit show Trailer Park Boys. You might know him as Cheeseburger Randy or just Randy. How you doing, my man? I'm doing great. How's it going, Shaggy? Not bad at all. I just wanted to say thank you so much for taking some time out of your day and your Trailer Park duties to give me a call today. Oh, my pleasure, my pleasure. We're just out on the road doing a whole bunch of Randy Cheeseburger picnics, and it's been a whole lot of fun. That's what I'm talking about. Now, tell me about this uh, comedy tour that you're on right now, the Randy Cheeseburger Picnic. How's it been going so far? It's been going good. You know, I kind of thought that maybe having a cheeseburger picnic the end of October would be too late in the year, but people don't care. They want to come out and party. They're out having a few drinky poos, and they come out and laugh, and we sing some songs and have games and contests. It's a great old time. I even bought a real good-looking ukulele player. Oh, can you play it? Oh, I can't, but the guy that I brought, <laughs> he, I think he's one of the most handsome men in the world, almost up there with Brad Pitt. All right. So, I mean, that's worth it coming out just to see that. His name's Shell. Shell. Shell, the ukulele-playing, yeah, good-looking man. He can't eat clams. He can't eat stuff like that, or he can't eat lobsters, even though his name's Shell. I know it's a little strange, but... He kind of smells fishy sometimes, but other than that, as long as the audience doesn't mind any fish smell, they can come and laugh and and sing along with Shell Shell. Okay, that'll be fantastic. Will you be doing some singing of your own? Oh, yes, definitely. we got some really good songs. All right, that'll be awesome, man. And I I take it any songs about cheeseburgers in there? We do do a real good cheeseburger song. That's my favorite song of all time. Cheeseburgers are my favorite food, Shaggy. Do you like cheeseburgers? Oh, who doesn't? I like them with onion rings on them. When you put the onion rings on them, it helps you go poo-poo. Oh, for sure. Well, I mean, onion rings and some barbecue sauce on there as well. Fry sauce. I don't know if you're familiar with fry sauce, but it's a big deal down here. I'm going to try some fry sauce, like a, a areoli or something. Oh, yeah, I'm telling like you, Randy, areoli. It, it'll change your life. If you haven't had fry sauce, then uh, it is a delicacy of Idaho. Oh, I'm going to try some. I can't wait. Yeah, you put some of that sucker on a cheeseburger, it will change your life, man. So uh, Trailer Park Boy's been going on for about 20 years now. It's hard to believe, you know. Well, it's just us living in Sunnyvale Trailer Park, and Julian hired this silly camera crew to follow us around and they catch us doing all kinds of weird stuff, Shaggy, you know. And people have seen me in my underwear. And they, they've definitely seen you without a shirt. I don't know if anyone's seen you with a shirt, actually. I wore a shirt one time, but I, it gave me a real bad rash. One time I had one of those tasty road vests on, gave me a rash. My nipples exploded. Oh, it man. Terrible. Well, see, and that's just the worst. I, I guess a hack to that is you got to put some Band-Aids over your nipples. Then at that point, then they won't I've, shave. Yeah. I've had those Band-Aids on. One time this girl twisted my nipple so hard that you're in black and blue. She was not nice. That, that doesn't sound nice at all. Why would she do such a thing? I don't know. She went for the purple nurple or something they call it. <laughs> Man, the dreaded purple nurple. But I'm allergic to shirts, Shaggy. I can't wear shirts. I don't like shirts. And, I mean, for me, I'm saving the environment. No laundry, no ironing. You don't have to match. So, I mean, I don't mind if everybody comes to the show with no shirt on. And and girls can come with no shirt, too. It doesn't matter. We all have boobies, and we all look good. (laughs) There you go. So, no shirt, plenty of service to go around, right? And we're going to have some cheeseburgers, too. That's what I'm talking about, man. Now, cheeseburgers, what what is your favorite kind of cheeseburger of the entire world? My favorite kind of cheeseburger is my next cheeseburger. I just want to keep eating them. I do like (laughs) them with two pieces of of, of cheese and two pieces of meat. It's It's a double cheese, double meat. And that's perfect. But I do put some veggies on because they do say the roughage is good and it does help it go out your poop shoot. Oh, of course. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, a solid choice in cheeseburger on on that part right there. So no shirts. Everything's all good to go. Now, here's a quick question for you. We are a classic rock station over here, a classic rock 94.9-1045, obviously. And I know you're from Canada. There's a lot of great rock and roll bands from Canada. Which one is your personal favorite? Well, you know, I didn't really know much about them until Bubbles told me about them, but but there's a band from Canada called Rush. Yeah! And they're really good. Uh, you know, they, it's only three guys in that band, and they can make it sound like it's a symphony. So I'd say that Rush is probably my favorite Canadian rock band. And, that, and I, I, I like your classic rock stuff. That's my kind of station. Oh, well, thank you, Randy. That's what I'm talking about. Rush is my personal favorite Canadian rock band as well. So a solid choice on that one for sure. So uh, just to reiterate, you're going to be in Pocatello at Duffy's this Friday night, right? Yeah, Pocatello at Duffy's. Yeah, it's going to be so much fun. It's going to be a great time. I can't wait to be there, Idaho.
Okay, and I expect we can expect some typical trailer park boys humor in your set. For sure. That's right. We, we do some good chants and some. I hope some good trailer park fans come over from Idaho. Oh, I guarantee that they will. Now, last question for you. How many cheeseburgers can you fit in your cheeseburger hole? Uh, it depends on what time of day. You know, it, it, I usually am quite hungry at breakfast. I can eat 10 burgers at breakfast. And if I do about 10 lawns between breakfast and lunch, for lunch I can eat 12 and some onion rings. But then at supper, I'm, I'm not quite so hungry. I, I can only do about eight. Okay, that, that's still a respectable number either way. Yeah, but these are just the little burgers, those little burgers, you know. Oh, so the little that, that, sliders. The quarter pounder ones, that's all. Oh, quarter pounder. Okay, that, yeah, no big deal. So once you get into that yeah. uh, that pound territory, then, then you get down maybe four. Well, then you just divide it by six or something. Okay, then it's... If there's it, six, six quarters in a pound, then you, that's what you divide by. That's when the math comes into place. There you go. Yeah. That's right. Fantastic. All right, everybody. Randy from Trailer Park Boys going to be at Duffy's this Friday night in Pocatello. So make sure you go and get your tickets. Anything else you need to say to the people, Randy? No, I just, I'm glad I got to talk to you, Shaggy. You've been a great guy. I hope that you can come out. Oh, you know it. I'll be there. Poke the fellow at my show. It'll be awesome. You know it. And Randy, thank you so much for watching over the Trailer Park. You're doing a great job. You're the best, Shaggy. We'll talk to you later. Hey, thanks. You too, man. We'll see you on Friday. Okay.